I just wanted to show off the dust collection features of my spindle mount here. Uh, this spindle mount is for a 65 millimeter spindle and the mount is designed to be 3D printable and it has some dust collection features and some other stuff going on. Uh, so this is how the, spin the dust collection system works. We start with the, what we call a sleeve and the sleeve is basically to hold in place the dust collection foot. Or maybe it's a hand, I don't know, to mix a metaphor. And the hand or foot is adjustable so it moves up and down and can be moved out of the work out of the way of the work if you need it to or it can move down and be really close and get really good dust collection. It also has this hole in it which allows the centering laser to pass through. So the mount features a, um, a centering laser which is pretty useful for getting things all lined up. But basically the way this works is the oopsie, the arm slides into slides into here and you can use uh, two M5 screws if you want to act as a set screw here. And it's all the way up position. You can see that it raises up above the collet, so it's impossible for you to kind of crash it into the work. And the down position, it comes down pretty far. It looks like about maybe an inch below the collet with the kind of stock length of this arm. Basically, this shoulder here, which acts as a vacuum cleaner adapter, just snaps right in. It's a little bit tight. There it goes, and it's not coming out now. And uh, this is all 3D printable. The only reason the color changed here is that at one point I ran out of filament. So a uh, one and a quarter inch shop vac hose just fits right in the top of this. The whole system can slide up or down depending on where you want it. And when you're done cutting, you can pull this out of here and use the hose to clean up your work area and plop it right back in. It's really pretty convenient. It's worked out pretty well for me so far. I've done a few cuts with it. And uh, one of the nice things about it is, at least with the hose I'm using, is it's very kind of pliable. And so it doesn't exert any uh, undue pressure kind of in the axis of the spindle. So, um, so yeah, I'm going to show some uh, cutting so you can get a feel for how well the dust collection system works. But overall, I'm very happy with it. You can see the centering laser shining through the middle of the dust foot and even sitting on top of it a little bit. But yeah, very happy with the system. You can find all the parts on Thingiverse.